vegan food is so popular right now, so I collected these vegetables from the market to make my own crusty base pizza. Two simple steps, amazing delicious pizza. Let's begin with step one. Step one is when I cut these vegetables, I got onions, mushrooms, courgettes, and these beautiful peppers, and a little bit of thyme herb that is gonna give it a really aromatic flavor. First, let's chop these together. done with step one chopping the vegetables they all go into this beautiful pan the peppers the courgettes the mushrooms the onions and then I have two cloves of garlic go all the way in chili flakes all the vegetables are in I've enlarged the pan because I want to make a larger pizza now the herb make sure the thyme is off the stock because that's gonna be hard to chew if you have a stock in there and I decided to add a few tomatoes, cherry tomatoes. Just like that, I just dropped them in. And the last part is a drizzle of extra virgin olive oil all over the place. And now I go in with my hands just to massage the olive oil in, uh, along with the uh, seasoning, the chili flakes, the garlic, and the wild thyme. I designed this the way I want my pie or pizza pie to look. So I want everything to lie flat. I've preheated my oven at 180 to 200 if you like. These are gonna go in for about 45 minutes and then the puff pastry is gonna go on top. All we have to do is just wait for these to roast. Dry. While I wait for my vegetables, I'm gonna hang out with Blue, my cat, and a cup of tea. Yeah, is that all right? And that's the end of step one. The vegetables are roasted. I just want to make sure that they are loose and how they look good and they sound good. Now step two is to lay this sheet of puff pastry on top of this and bake it back in the oven for about half an hour. Step two, into the oven. And that sound reminds me that it is done. And it looks like it is done. Ooh, that looks good. Look at that. The minute you see that it's moving that way, that means it's good to flip. Ready? And it dropped. Yes. Good. There it is. Look at that. Let's put some cheese in here. This is vegan cheese that I got from the supermarket. It's made of coconut uh, oil and milk. It's delicious, so I'm substituting dairy for vegan because it's a vegan dish. Uno, dos, this is fresh basil. And now I'll put it back in the oven for another five minutes to grill on top. And there it is, it's done and it looks absolutely fantastic. I'm just gonna drop this over. Time to cut it and eat. Superb. The vegetables are very nicely roasted. The thyme is giving it a lot of beautiful aroma. The basil on top, absolutely gorgeous. Simple, easy, and delicious. Please make it at home. Zahdin. My name is Iyad Kasem. I'm a qualified chef from Le Cordon Bleu and I hope you like this recipe and if you do like my recipes please follow me on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube and click like if you like them and let me know what you think. I hope you like this pizza. Hi, bon appetit.